Hello, everybody. This is Gleaming Cold. Back with the first video of 2024. This is very exciting because, I don't know, well, mainly because it is 2024. It's a new year. Two-year anniversary of the channel is coming up. But, um, yeah. Anyways, this is not about that. It's not a channel update video. This is a redo of an older video. Okay. It's my Star Wars ranking tier list, if you could not tell by the thumbnail. It was an old video. I just... Opinions changed and other things like that, so I wanted to remake it. Plus, I've watched, like, one or two more. So, yeah. A few disclaimers. One, this is my opinion. If you don't agree with me, that's fine, but this is my opinion, and if you want to make your own opinion, tell me in the comments. Uh, two, any of the shows or TV show uh, or movies I have not watched will be put in a separate tier called Haven't Watched Yet. Mainly because... I haven't watched them. I have no opinion on them. Um, shows that I have also, or TV shows, I, I mean movies, I have barely watched. This mainly goes for the TV shows. Shows uh, that I have not watched really will not be counted. But anything that was like, I don't know, a very high amount of watching, enough to where I can understand it a lot better, I'll count those. But not ones I've barely watched. So, yeah, we should get into the tier list. So, on the tier list I have selected, because I do not make this tier list, this is just a pre-selected one I found, we've got Rogue One. Um, I think it's a good movie. I mean, it's got some issues, but very minor. I'm gonna put it in, hmm, I don't know, honestly, I haven't watched this movie in a while, so I haven't really caught up, to be honest. I'm gonna put it in good it's not bad it's just in my opinion it could be better but i actually do like it it's not a bad movie at all so second on this list we got what the fuck is skeleton crew uh haven't watched i have not i've not even heard of that so um yeah um easy i haven't watched it i have no opinion for number three we have the ahsoka series now this one i had just recently watched and i'm putting that in great People may not like it. I don't know if people don't like it. I haven't really stayed up top of it. This is only my opinion. I like it. I really like it a lot. I don't know if there's two seasons, but from what I... I it only looked I had eight episodes in the first season, but I could be wrong. I really enjoyed this show, to be completely honest. It was a good show. It wasn't too long, but it was also a... In my opinion, it was a good, great show, honestly. There were slight... Things I didn't understand, and the Night Sisters just terrify me. But that's just a normal thing. Um, yeah, but that that's just me. So yeah. All right. The next one is The Mandalorian. Um, I've watched four episodes, but not enough of it to actually be good enough for ranking. From what I hear, it's a great show, but I have to sadly put it in haven't watched it because yes, even though I watched the first four episodes i haven't watched enough of it and that was about a year ago so i gonna be honest that's probably one i need to start watching again um yeah that's gonna probably piss people off but i do not care i have not watched it so yeah so next one we have is the solo movie not a solo movie you, you know what i mean anyways um this is another one i've watched again pretty recently and originally i actually enjoyed this quite a bit it's kind of soured on me over time. Like, don't get me wrong. I don't think it's bad. Uh, but it's just... Eh. Something about it just kind of left me. So I'm gonna put it in meh. Though it could be in good. I just... Something soured on me, that's all. So... And yeah, again, my opinion. So, yeah. Next one is a classic. Episode 4. Uh, that's going in god tier. That is immediately going into god tier. This is actually probably my favorite Star Wars movie. I get it's the first one, but it's my favorite one. I know people like Return of the Jedi more or Revenge of the Sith more, but I personally think that Episode 4 is a god-tier uh, movie. I always enjoy it when watching it. I never have it. There's not a single moment I dislike about it. It's just a fantastic movie. All right, so the next few, um, uh, they're all TV shows. 
And all of these I have not seen. So I'm just going to do a quick misfire round of basically saying Visions, haven't watched. Alkalite, I don't even know what, I think I'm saying that wrong. I don't even know how you say that per- correctly. I think I definitely said that wrong. I don't, I haven't watched it. Tales of the Jedi, haven't watched it. Resistance, I completely keep forgetting that thing even exists. Andor, here it's good. I haven't watched it. Uh, Book of Boba Fett, I haven't watched Mandalorian. So, and I've been heard from one of my friends that this is kind of, it, it's supposed to tie in with the Mandalorian. So again, I haven't watched it. Rebels, uh, haven't really watched except for like one or two episodes. Don't count it. Bad Batch, definitely have not counted because I haven't watched it. So yeah, Misfire round over. All right, now, Miss Fire Round is over. The rest that we get to talk about are things I have seen. So, starting with Obi-Wan Kenobi. This is a great show. It's about on par, in my opinion, with Ahsoka. Though, maybe Ahsoka could be a little bit better. Um, But again, I think, at least in my opinion, I'm going to put it in great. In personally. So, yeah. All right. We're about to have the most unpopular opinion. Force Awakens. I... I like it. Okay? The other two sequels suck. But I do think the Force Awakens was good. In my opinion. Do I think it's better than Solo? Yes, I do. I mean, that's going to sound so sacrilege to say. But I like it more than Solo. Uh, probably because it feels a lot like uh, Episode 4. But a lot probably worse definitely i like it it's the only sequel that i actually like um i'm gonna put it in good but it's not as good as rogue one don't get me wrong it's just i do think it's decent so yeah i do actually think it's decent in my opinion all right going from a from a controversial one to a definitely, people are going to agree with me. Clone Wars, the TV show, is definitely um, a god tier. Now, you still haven't watched the second, seventh season, and you could say, well, you haven't finished it. You're putting it in, um, you could put it in, haven't watched. I've watched enough of it to where I'm going to count it, honestly. I've watched enough of it. It's great. It's amazing. I definitely think it deserves to go in, um god tier so yeah all right another quick fire round the other two sequel series ones oh fuck those suck no those immediately go to bottom tier not the haven't watched that doesn't that's not the bottom tier bottom tier burn it at a stake that these movies suck I'm not going to tell you why. I'm just going to make you watch. I'm just going to tell you. Watch it and then come back here and understand that these suck. I like Last Jedi a little bit more. A little tiny bit more than The Rise of Skywalker. I'm sorry for that weird pause. Um, but still, they're su- they just suck. They suck. They suck. They suck. And yeah, that's the last quick fire round. So, yeah. All right. The next um, movie we have is Episode 3, Revenge of the Sith. I might not like this one as much as Episode 4, but I still think it's a god-tier one. Honestly, I think this is... Yeah, it's just a god-tier one. I do like the prequels quite a bit. And this one just... This one's a great one, in my opinion. So. Alright, next one we have Episode 2. Um, I think it's great. There are issues I have with it, but they're very minor. So I'm going to put it at great. I do really like this. It had the amazing Battle of Geonosis, which I love. But I do think... Oh, and it introduced the Clone War... The Clone Wars, no, Clone Troopers. I just feel like it's not as good as Episode um, 4 and 3, in my opinion, so... All right, we're down to the final three, and we're going to have Empire Strikes Back go in great. Actually, this one has an interesting story, because originally, when I was much younger, I hated this movie for some odd reason. I don't know what I hated about it. It's just, there was something, I, I don't know, I, just, I kind of hated it, and I don't know why I hated it, but I watch it now, and I actually really like it. I don't think it's as good as Revenge of the Sith or uh, 
the uh, episode four, but I think this is still a great movie. And same for the last three, honestly. So I think we might as well get through for, um, those. Um, but yeah. All right. Second to last movie is Return of the Jedi. That one's going god tier. This one is an amazing movie. Again, um, I do like episode four more, but just slightly more. Probably because it was the first one I saw, and yeah. But this one is amazing. I love Return of the Jedi, um, especially the final battle. So, yeah, Return of the Jedi goes in god tier. For the final movie, we have episode one, The Phantom Menace. I think personally this will this will go in great tier because everything about it is just solid. It's not godlike like the others, in my opinion. Shut up. I swear if people get at, angry at me for this. Um but yeah, personally this is actually not bad. I actually think it's a great movie. It basically just sets up what happened everything like everything before episode 4 and onwards and I like that. Though, technically, that's the entire prequel's point, but this one just sets it up for the very beginning. And I really, really like it. Um, so, yeah, that's the final movie in my tier list. And that's it for today's video of Star Wars ranking videos. Yes, I know this is a redo, and I could have done something new, but I just, I don't know, I felt like just taking, first of all, a break from World War Slits for a little bit, and redoing one of my older videos that i I was happy with, but things have changed, and I wanted to update it a little bit. So, yeah, that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed today's video, please like, subscribe, comment down below your feedback. I'm always reading you guys' comments, and join up on your, my Discord server. We're always having a lot of fun there, and yeah, bye.